require Whose something. Whose grave is that? Take this. Take this. Um, take this. No, I can't cheese it. You can get a shovel somewhere in the game, and... No, uh, you have to give it a sword. Shush. You get that later. Don't tell me the secrets. I must learn. Unless I'm genuinely suck and w stuck, in which case then tell me. <laughs> but you don't even I love how throwing a tiny pebble will knock down a bunch of branches. <clears throat> don't question it. You're right, we should not question our forefathers and forebearers. Is there anything else around here on the ground in the grass? Oh, look, a puzzle. It's a puzzle, but I have no direction as of right now, so let's see what this says. X marks the spot. Hmm. It's a very simple puzzle, if you think about it. No, I don't feel like thinking. I'm just trying to figure out how to ditch stuff really quick. Pick up that rock. Put it here. Give... Oh, shift click. So all you have to do is make an X. Neat. Yeah. <coughs> Good, I can also pick up everything afterwards. Glorious. <sighs> yes, because I don't want to give up my precious, precious rocks. That's right, you actually have no use of these right now. But it's nice that they actually give us a spell from the very get-go that we could use. What's in the other direction? I'm curious. Excuse me, just let me beat my face into the wall for a brief moment. Hmm. This looks like a ritual circle. Praise be to the dark gods. Praise be to it, Mark. No, I, I'm going to praise the glory of chaos in this case. Uh, do not act... Um, you, you need an I, uh, thing of a bopper to... Shh. Do not tell us these things. Don't I spoil it. Welcome to the location well, you of your first challenge. Even. When you're ready, stand in the circle and call out the Guardians, the Island Master. Fight! Hmm. You disappoint me. Unless there's an item around here. I'm probably going to require a golden key. Oh no, the golden key opens this. So I can't call out the Guardians right now. No, not until you get a specific island. I Shush. Don't. Hey, I'm not saying what kind of item you need. It's the principle of the matter. I must shut up a precedence. Even though, admittedly, I just threw that out the window half the time anyway. If you can review the tutorial, you can look up a hint later. Oh, hi there. I don't like you. Oh, by the way, enemies respawn all the time. That's acceptable. That means we can actually infinitely level up and make infinite turtle soup. You can come out of hiding, Mr. Trident Wielder. I can play this game much oh, longer great. than you can. A fish man. If so I were we're a fishman. So we're gonna have fish for dinner. Well, Zarok. Not Zarok. Well, Dark, we don't have to cook you now. Sorry, what? We don't have to cook you now. We have fish for dinner. I don't like fish. There you go. I was wondering when you would die. You don't drop the trident. <clears throat> I'm sorry, but we're in the middle of a deserted island. So you're going to eat fish, and you're going to like it. I will starve. Okay, we'll cut off your left arm and serve back. Happy? Now, here's a better plan, all right? We'll cut off your right arm. Yes, cut off the arm of the minotaur that actually fights. <laughs> Exactly. If you're strong enough, you can beat all the opponents with one arm. Get over here. I'll just have the wizard because the wizard has an auto no, you do is throw Like All you do is throw stones. You need one arm for that. I need a hand to carry the stones. No, you got a bag for that. Out of energy. Oh my goodness. Fishman. Just take your beats and die. You're gonna eat fishman and you're gonna like it. Don't eat fishman. Fishman the theme enemy. What? Too bad fishman cannot drop food. 
No, it's dropping it, food. We're just forcing Zarak. Not Zarak. Dark to eat it. What about his weapon? Oh, finally dead. He doesn't drop weapons. That'd be too kind. I see in his hand. I see it in his hand. We break too. him. Legend of Kilhagen. The second most precious thing in life for a seafaring captain is his sword, because without it he cannot command his crew. Thus, upon losing his weapon somewhere on Shipwreck Beach, he lost what's most important to him, the respect of his crew. So, on the beach, there's a sword, possibly. Probably not. <clears throat> so, I'm going to probably. Oh, there comes another. You're all kind of peckish, so let's just give everyone turtle. Turtle steaks for all. I never, I, never, I never read the letter anyway. Dear visitor, welcome to my island. I hope your journey was not too detrimental to your health. I think you'll find this island to be most wonderful, yet the most perilous place on earth. I don't have high hopes about your survival, but maybe you can prove me wrong. Better equip yourself before the night falls. You might want to feed me a bit more food. You need to be hungry first. We might as well be efficient. <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. bro. Uh, don't worry, I'll equip you with all items that make it so whenever you need to feed, you'll basically need to feed the most often out of the entire group. Hmm, I'm going to free this space up before it tries to kill me. Ooh, peasant's cap. I can actually equip some armor to the head. My goodness, oh my goodness. And falcon Come on, stride. you only have one peasant here. Yes, but even you don't deserve it. Blood drop cap, so they give us mana potions right off the bat. But I don't think we have the ability to actually mix them yet. Uh, all you need is mortar and pestle. We don't have that. I'm just building up resources at this point. Wingate Terminus East. We need a key. There's a button here. You have a key. We ran out of keys. Oh. Eh. To and fro, no fear. Cavalier, renegade, steer clip. What is this? Oh, hi, Turtle Man. The Terminus West. Why did I step out into that mess? Come forward, Turtle Man. You're only giving me more time to repair. So glad that magic exists here in this party. He's the one that's doing all the work as of right now. Ooh, well, when I hit, I do quite a bit of damage. Oh, we got a sling. All right, well, we might as well drop the darts in favor of giving you more rocks. And then, of course, take the sling on you so we could store food in there, putting all the turtle meat into it. We'll even have the bag of turtle. And then we'll probably. The legendary bag of turtle. No, that's the loot fisk cube. <laughs> what is this? Oh, right. Right, old mechanics. Um, shift click handle, put one over there. We'll grab the chest. A dagger and the gold key. Excellent. Who should have the dagger? It's a light weapon, dexterity, throw is a special attack. Well, it's a throwing weapon, so... A healing potion as well. Excellent. I'm going to try not to cough immediately, and... Alright, and give me that dart back. Alright, so we've got some good things going for us. Is there anything else around Terminus West that's usable? Oh, that's what that gold key is for. Okay. Well, uh, no, it's for in here. Can I? No, I can't smack you. That makes me so sad. Open up, back up, move back, turn around. Put these in here, put this sling... No ammo. 
I forgot how ammunition works. Please uh, you just excuse right, me. Just right click the weapon that uses it. And you make sure that the ammo is still in there. There we go. One down, one to go. Come on. I don't know if hitting them in transition works anymore. I would assume if they're moving, you cannot hurt them. Mostly because I think we're wasting the wizard shots by doing this. There we go. Can we please kill you? You're trying to run away. It's not working. There we go. They're all dead. All of them, finally. And we'll rest. And feast. Just take a look at what our torch looks like. That's almost out. But it's daytime. Congratulations. We've survived one night here on... Grimrock Isle 2. <coughs> There's more yes, shipwrecks. Yes, stone broke by the looks of it. You no, know, wait, we saw it by... It just looked like a three from a distance. Sea bass, a shovel, a rapier. Oh, requires light weapons. At the lone oak in the shadow of the blue light, I buried it. And scroll of poison cloud. Sea bass. Sure, we'll take our shovel. A lot of things require digging. So I'm going to be digging holes this time. Diggy diggy Great. hole. That takes the rapier. I'm not going to give up the rapier just yet. We're going to go and immediately take the shovel down here. And see what awaits us. Oh hey, I didn't even notice these throwing daggers. Please excuse me. Uh, what are your stats? Yeah, your strength is stupidly high. Missile, does, is, is this a dex weapon? Because if it's a dex weapon, then I'm literally wasting your time. Yes, I am wasting your time. You're much better with throwing knives. And then throwing the rocks after when the knives eventually fail. Uh, wrong way. Although I can't dig up there. Alright, so... Down here, we're going to try putting the rapier. Greetings! There's the golden key. And then the note said what again? At the lone oak in the shadow of the blue light, I buried it. So it's going to be down here, the shadow of the blue light on this side... Pull out. Where did I put that shovel? Don't oh, forget to take the rapier me. back. I took the rapier back. Okay, just trying to make sure. You could probably use it for the other statue. There we the go. Way. Digging, digging. At the digging. very beginning. Oh, I know that that's possible. I know that that's a possibility, but I'm just opening up these chests anyway. Embalmers' no, robes. No, I'm and... talking about take the rapier to the first statue back on the beach first statue back on the beach let us go and check remember because... the statue you tried putting everything on that was that one i think i just tried but i will go no and check. there was another one be there was one before it the first w statue you found shush don't worry i am intelligent also first level up because that came very quickly Unspent skill point. I'm going to continue investing in heavy weapons. Actually, no, what am I doing? I'm going to invest in armor. Because I don't have a heavy weapon yet. Well, you do. You get the bone club. I have the heavy weapon. I have the bone club. It's just not great right now. Now, first statue. My brain might not be working properly, but I'm going to go take a look. It was in a little alcove by itself.
Hmm. I see nothing at all. I must be. It was cur towards the beginning. I'm at the very beginning. I remember a statue. I will go off your memory. Hmm, this seems wrong. Because you tried giving it it giving it food for half a minute. It wasn't at the very beginning, but it was still on the beat. It was before you did the first puzzle, I believe. Okay, I'm in that general area, and I'm just gonna run through it and see how fast I can uh, see how fast I can do so. I do love the giant stone head. Most definitely, the architecture here is a definite improvement of Grimrock One. No, yes, that's... it's no longer cave, cave, more cave. Oh it's... look, dungeon walls, and then cave. It's now pretty. Okay, so in this little alcove, this is where I got the key, but it's not exactly a puzzle. The first puzzle, you mean the first, like, floorboard puzzle, correct? Where you put down one item. I think it was right next to the water. I, I think you guys are both crazy, but... Maybe no. we are, because I don't... Because I remember you were playing with a statue for a little while. That, I think that was the one that was just behind the boat. Yeah, no, it uh, was before the boat. No, because the only other... Because I remember other, sand. The, the only other statue that's there is just behind the boat, because I just literally, like, rubbed my face all over it. Because the statue in question you're probably thinking of... Oh, hi, turtle. This is going to vex me until you're better at ranged weapons, freaking farmer. And... Farmers can't get skills, can they? No, they have to, because just leveling up does nothing without the skill points. They do... I think they do get skills, they just don't get at the first level up. There we go. People are leveling. Everything is going well. All is well that shall be well. Anyway, as I said, you mean this statue right here that I'm looking at? It's gonna I catch up. It's gonna catch it up yet. on the stream. I'm just You're still fighting the turtle. Y you'll see it in a moment. Game saved. Skills. All right. I can't punch. It makes me sad. That might be it. I can't rapid fire fisticuffs. Yeah, that was it. I have to do this. Oh, fine. I'm going to boost his dodge. Oh, um, there's still that statue. Oh. I'm ignoring it. <clears throat> that that goes down into a cave. You know what we're gonna do? I'm gonna give you light weapons. If I can't have anything else, then I'll give you light weapons. I know there's that statue down there. I'm ignoring it because I've got a golden key that I need to spend. Also, Mr. Wizard, yes, get me fire magic. We're gonna boost it to something that doesn't suck. Give You're me a bite to eat. It. I might need a bite to eat. Potion of strength, pellets, and a backbiter. Backbiter, Back light that. weapons three, yeah. and sp yeah. leech. So, are you just going to be going down the Thunder Mage path again? No, I'm going on Fire Mage right now. Like, I'm actively going down Fire Mage. Oh, yes, and um, you've got your stick. You've got your branch, but we're going to give you the rapier, considering you can actually use that weapon. And so, how long till all more. our magical artifacts are stolen off of us again? Um, give or take two minutes. And I get bumped in the head and forget how to use a bow. Well, you're a simple farmer again. That's the only thing you remember. And that's how it shall remain. 
Hey, turtle. Die, turtle. I'm getting efficient at killing them, at least. And we're getting a lot of turtle meat. And we'll rest once again to regain our magic points. And we'll feed you with a turtle steak. I'm just wondering something. Does different foods give me different amount of experience? Possibly. Dungeon the First. Hmm, this is used? So does it still have light? It does. Can I do the same trick before, Grimrock style, and put in a used... Yes, I can. Excellent. Halls of the Dead. Let's not go there, that sounds scary. For a first level party. Right, I should actually like hold on to the torch and see what's going on. I don't wonder, do they have the traditional buttons? Oh, I see something in there. Ah, glittering gold. Trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. Lock okay, picks. Dark, I need you to come over here. We need to bleed you. You have to pay for something. Say what? <sighs> There's some trinkets and baubles we have to buy. And we need blood for it. Oh, here, I got some blood I took from you in your sleep. I need to know what poisons worked. I'm a minotaur. We're poison resistant. I got a very point pointy stick. <laughs> oh, hey, they're mummies. <laughs> right, fire magic would do insane amounts of damage to these things. Yep. That's why you yeah, got they're wrapped magic. around in dried bandages, salted slightly. They make good field snacks. They make nice. They make nice kindling. Yes. Fun fact: mummies were actually used to run many trains during the Victorian era. No. No, that's actually true. Another boots. Over in Egypt. Let's go, and the shuffle continues. Congratulations. There were so many of them that they ended up just using them to run steam engines. Is that a desecration of the dead? Oh, it's the British. They have always desecrated the dead. And there's a button here. So what does this reveal? The way up. Let's not go there just yet. I love how you actively avoided giving me any armor. Yep. Because oh, hey, there's a front lock. The one so you're going to be using person. pistols. What the heck is this button? Uh, dagger is nice, but we're not doing it. Because you're not a dex character, correct? Stats. Yes, your strength. Well, you can make me dex. Uh, put something on the... I, I already solved it. Hi. Trust me, you guys are 15 seconds behind, and unlike a lot of other LPers, I'm actually clever in most instances. I just pretend to be stupid. Uh, okay, I, know, I, I, yes. see your I see your disapproving eyes. I know you don't believe me. You pretend. <laughs> yes, Rainboy <laughs> pretends the, to be stupid. Even the game, our avatars in the game are looking at you like... What the fuck is wrong with him? Oh, hey, mummies. Curse of the Dark Pharaoh much? Come on, you two. I'm only waiting here for you. Come on, come over here so we can throw you into a steam engine. Hit this button should kill him. It does. Uh, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Let's go. I'm waiting for you. Don't forget to go up the secret door that you found. I'm currently not forgetting. I just want to get what... I want to finish up whatever's here first. And I do want to see how firearms work. Horn Same of, as oh. every other weapon in the game. Horn of Summoning. The horn has a pugnant earthy smell. That's what I need for the other area to summon things for the first challenge. 
Interesting. Interesting. Uh, let's rest. That's the first boss in the game, too. Da 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 da. Oh, you actually need food. Take some, wizard. What is fluffy, the li fluffy the fluffy the lizard. Uh, okay, so this is actually an enclosed area. I love how it gives me the tutorial to change party member location now. Oh, this presses a button to reveal a new location. Okay. Proving once again how interconnected this place actually is. And I like this map. Um, is there anything else here that I'm missing? Nothing so obvious and nothing so bold. I apparently missed just going straight up there. No, that's how I entered in before. Okay. Okay, the map makes more sense now. Let's go back down here and go through said secret area. Who knows, maybe the dead come here in infinity. Also, if I have access to wizards and the undead are clearly apparent here, why can't I just pragmatically pick up necromancy? I mean, seriously, it's not like I can just run like a necromancy RTS. There's, sadly, there's no books about it. Yeah. You can't really talk to the dead to figure out how to use That's the some entire of them. Okay. That's the entire beginning point of necromancy, is just trying to talk to the dead. Yeah, sorry. The closest thing you got to necromancy is my head, Mancy, where I pick up a head and gain an even soul to gain strength. That's not how that works. Anyway, secret area, what? Oh, hi. There's a lot of turtles here. I guess this is the entire point of this area. Food. Do you need food yet? You don't. We need to get the items that make it so your food consumption goes through the roof. Locked. Jammed. I already need 25% more food. You need more. You need to eat more. I'm okay, so that's bought. how this works. Theorem, yes. tribal well, mask, I'm and a healing potion. Hungry. Hey, I'm slightly peckish. You can feed me. No. Feed him. No. Do it. He's just before leveling up. He will never level up. Anyway, so the tribal mask. What does this do? Um, protection energy without light armor proficiency. That's annoying, but we'll get the light armor proficiency next level. Peasant's cap can go down to the next person who actually needs it. By the way, she's the only one wearing pants. Everyone's just running around, buck naked, mm. wild, and free. Apparently. Well, one person... Well, two people don't have normal genitalia. No, I, I just and... see they're running buck naked. They could all be Ken dolls down there. <laughs> well, two of them... <laughs> would technically be Ken dolls, seeing how both of them technically... Anyway, let's not discuss this right now. No. <laughs> Shut up, Pluto. I'm sorry I know biology. And we'll just swap those around. Turn this off. We will rest again because it'll go to daytime. And we'll get up. Oh, I never took the embalmer's robe, robes. Whoops. And you'll get the better shirt of protection. Then the wizard will get the next shirt. Sorry. Sleep awake. And eventually I'll get a pair of sandals. Eventually, he says, thinking he's a person. <laughs> <laughs> um. So let's hey, continue. I do all the cooking here. You've handed us. You've handed them raw turtle flesh. No, I cook it. I raw steal the torch and fry it. Turtle flesh. <laughs> it is not raw. I salt it. Raw turtle flesh. It is salted. Where do you get the salt? Salt water? Water? Why do you think what do you think I'm carrying around on my back everything in the boxes? 
That's a waste of time, and how do the boxes hold water? Very carefully. They're all waterproof. So how do I use this horn exactly? You blow on it. Viper roots. Oh, hi there. Interesting. Prepare for most awful <laughs> thing of all time. Oh, okay, there's multiple. Right. Yes, there's two. Goodbye, you're gonna die. No, I can be not stupid. Uh, fire's their weakness, so use that. Uh, up. And they have ranged poison attacks. Yeah, so I kind of figured. I should use the potion of strength as of right now, and wow, they hurt. They hurt long time. They hurt me long time. Alright, where's their next appearance? Well, when we kill them, we won't run out of firewood for a while. That's assuming they're even usable, considering their bodies seemingly go back underground with each usage. Fizzling. My absolute favorite, so we now have to wait for the wizard to be usable again. Yes, until you get, like, concentration so high, you can basically... It only increases the amount of mana I've got. It doesn't actually increase mana regen. Yeah, and getting fire damage up is also really good. It is. Alright, where's the next Viper Root? Hi there. And that's one down, at least. Well, you might want to give the wizard the pistol or firearm so you'll be at abuse during the battle. No, because then I'll think of him as something else other than a wizard, and that's a problem. The the wizard would literally need the <clears throat> firearm skill. Extreme to be gardening. Useful. Power gem. What be this? Beautiful gem that radiates light in all colors of the spectrum. Thing for the story gonna just feed some people because everyone is getting a little bit hungry. The Minotaur is of course not hungry because reasons. Oh, that's right, because the Minotaur doesn't actually do anything. Um <laughs> the Minotaur is worthless. It's not like I can do anything. You're not letting me do anything. So the power gem, I don't have any clue what that does. I'm just curious and I might want to explore this place, but let's go forward into the forest. Hello. I'm slightly peckish. I can eat a bite. No. And finally level up. You're not allowed. You're not allowed to level up. <laughs> Letter. I see you've made some minor progress. Good, good, but don't get let it get, let it get to your head. This is just the beginning, or it could almost be the end. It depends entirely on you. Here's a tool you might find useful. Surely you can figure it out. Blood drop cap for healing potion and ether weed for the knot. Congratulations, you can be made useful. Woo, I can make potions. You can, but we need... Oh, wait, can we just make potions in the Mortar and Pestle, or do we actually yes. have to? Sorry, that's not how this works. I just put it inside there. Needs it in his... Oh, it requires it in his hand. Yes. Actually, that's where... Switching... Um... <clears throat> Loadouts comes in handy. Uh, oh, hum. First things first, I'm going to put all the alchemist stuff in one bag so it's actually not that hard to find everything. And then I've been neglecting to put the food away into something useful. Uh, take this note. Put all the food in here. I could see how the switching loadouts would actually be bloody useful. So what is going to be your loadout too? Mortar and Pestle. Oh, it has the Diablo style, where having separate loadouts means you can have different sets of equipment on it. And a yeah. Bora. Oh, hi there. That startled me briefly. Treebeard, you've 
become tiny. Uh, no, I wanted to fire. Thank you. Everything early game seems to be weak to fire. I don't know if this is to my benefit or not. Uh, there we go. Benefit. It's dead. Okay, instead of walking mushrooms, we have walking root. Walking trees. Thank you very much. Hmm, so they actually have different movement styles to try to confuse me. Naturally, this doesn't work, but they have them at least. Interesting. Interesting. Um, uh, I like this game more already than Grimrock 1. It is what they should do with a sequel and make definite improvements on it. Except they removed the one thing you loved. Yes, fisticuffs. Alright, it's enough for me. I mean, head off to bed. Acceptable. I might end up canceling the stream a little bit earlier after these fights than is intended, if only because I'm going to probably start losing people anyway, and people are going to have to get to sleep, and I have to get ready for an RP in the morning. Well, the good news is I might be able to make Mondays. Fair enough. Alright, see you all later. Good night. Good night. Night. Have night levels. All the levels. And I'm yeah. still level one. And Fluffy is keeping herself busy. I'm from Rock. It's just I can't level normally. <laughs> now I'll take a blood drop cap. Why not? And. Here, babbling brook. Can I finally eat a piece of turtle? No. No, you're not allowed. Oh, hey. What is in this glorious sack? A healing potion, baked maggots, and the scroll of poison bolt. I'll take the baked maggots. No, you're not allowed. <laughs> Da, 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 da. Take the blood drop cap. Hmm, we might actually have to rest here for a little while. Of course, it's nighttime. Well, you know what? Since it's nighttime, we'll actually call it here. In game time. When we return to Grimrock, we'll return. But for now, we're gonna call it for night for the stream as well as for the stream as well as the series for now i couldn't have put that in any worse way but we'll continue next time is we're what gonna I say. yes that's better farewell